In today's Apple Numbers spreadsheet demonstration, I'm going to show you how to add multiple rows within the sheet. So the first way to add multiple rows is by highlighting the cell and this little circle in the bottom left hand corner will pop up and you can keep clicking this and multiple rows will be added. Or a quicker way is by clicking this little circle in the bottom right hand corner and holding it and then dragging it downwards or upwards. This will either add or take away multiple rows. And the third way is by highlighting a row and then holding down shift and highlighted another row. So in this case, we'll highlight row 11 and click row 14. So we've highlighted four rows. And then you want to right click, I'll press the little down arrow here, and this will bring up the menu. And then you want to select either add rows above or below. And this will add four new rows. We can also do this to a table. And then we'll right click, I'll press the little down arrow. And in this case, we'll select add rows below. However, as you can see, when we add new team members, when you add new numbers, these are not totaled. So let's quickly command and Z to go backwards. So let's highlight row three, and then click add a row. And let's add another row. Now let's highlight both of these rows, three and four, and add row above. Now we have quickly added four new rows. But as you have added them between the cells, now when you add numbers, the function will carry on and these will be totaled below. So let's quickly command and Z again, and let's get it back to the original. And that's a basic look how to add multiple rows to Apple Numbers. I hope you found that video helpful, and if you did, check out this playlist here, where we have many other Apple Numbers spreadsheet demonstrations. And thank you for watching.